you what, know. What, what would be your top five Dark Child production? songs for sharing my, sharing my world album right here all of them i can love you can't get you off my mind searching uh share my world a dream that was on a on a, on a money talk soundtrack the thank you lord interludes i did them all in one night on a sunday night right over here i did all the tracks and then the next day the next night i had mary j had a listening session with a bunch of producers and i presented all my tracks and she chose them all for that album i did don't want to be a player for joe right here I'll never forget me and Jaffe doing the track and I actually did the hook, sang the hook with Jaffe right here in this in this basement. I did the boy's mind for Brandy and Monica right here. Mm -hmm. That's where I would create all my tracks. Um, so many hits. I would start right in the basement. It's funny because now when you really think back, I think as you get older and as you progress and you become successful, you start getting all this equipment and you need this type of equipment. But back then I have like all of that. I just knew how to make what I had work. So any aspiring young producer that's out there, any about having everything is about making what you have work and making it into hit songs. And those hit so those are songs now that'll be here for forever. The Boys Mind actually broke the Beatles record from jumping from 27 to one. And it was number one for about 13 weeks. And sold millions of singles and it was created right here at 4202 Randy Courtney's landed. Ooh, I never, I never <laughs> can ask that question. Um, top five. Um, I'm probably going to go, am I working backwards or starting at yeah, one? It, it, you, no, well, you, no, five, I'll start at five. Yeah, start at five, yeah. I'll start at five. I had to go, if I had to play five right now, from a production from a production standpoint, um, number five I'm probably going to play is um, I'm going to play. He wasn't man enough. Okay, Tony Braxton. I'm going to go four. I'm going to go to um, from a production standpoint. I'm going to go probably to Brandy. Um, what about us? Okay. Just because it was just so different at the time when it came out. Three, I'm gonna go to uh, Michael Jackson, probably Unbreakable. Mm. Um, and then two, I'm gonna go to I Can Love You, Mary J. Blige. And then one, I'm gonna go to Say My Name, Dusty Shop. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe and turn on the notification button, but also check out our membership offers where you can actually watch all these videos um, as soon as they're released, um, especially without any of those uh, YouTube ads. But thanks again for watching and being part of the Halftime Chat community. I, 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 I.